All right, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to more Little Hope. My name is Raven from the Sky. Let's do this. That thing looks to have gone, but it could come back any time. We have to keep moving. Oh, look at that. The heck is that? The heck is that thing? Town in ruin. Ah, okay. What? Yes. We'll try to forget I just saw this. Mr. Clark leaving the Little Hope Police Department yesterday. A line has been drawn under the tragic case of Clark's house fire. Onlookers watched as Anthony Clark, the only survivor of the blaze, was released from police. Thursday afternoon, one onlooker said, That poor boy. He must be going through hell right now. The Herald approached Mr. Clark for a comment, but he has not. <coughs> Blamed Clark, who was found with a box of matches in his hand at the scene for causing the fire. When Clark left the Little Hope Police Department, passer fires were heard to burn in hell. Wow. You see that? Stay on your toes. Anything could happen. No one in Little Hope is safe while you still draw breath, Joseph. You must die today. Museum. Not even your wife Amy was spared your lust to serve Satan. Damn me if you must. 
You're not fit. Speaking of my late wife. There is still fight in you. I must drive the devil out for the safety of everyone here. Oh, no one is safe. Joseph, do you renounce the devil and all his teachings? I carry no sin. I'm no disciple of the devil. I found his infection with madness. Roy, but saints, servants, barely. We have to stop this. Oh my god. I feel like it wouldn't have done anything on, if we were to confront her. What, what, what would that have Look, done? There can be no more doubting. This is witchcraft. More stones. The devil must be crushed you know within what? him. It... Do not flinch. The fate of little... Oh, shoot. Every time we help, it makes it worse. It, because he, by us being a spirit, they can't Your see us. Meaning that, oh my god, it just dawned on me. I've been making the wrong decisions all along. It, oh my god. Because this did, it nearly did nothing. Oh my god. That's it. And I think that's the last one. God, damn Raven. I've been making the wrong decisions all along. I can't believe it didn't dawn on me. That's why I kept saying, look at, hey, this is witchcraft at its finest. This is, he said that every time. What is this trickery? What is this? What is that? We're screwed. There is no way out from this nightmare. We don't have a lot of time. Time for what? John! What are you doing? I'm done running! Time for payback for Taylor and Daniel! Are you crazy? We gotta move! Oh, shoot. Here we go. She is... Indifferent, desertive, understanding, truthful, abrasive. John, please hurry! We are of water. Saved Angela. Come on, you fucking Whenever I get that stupid, those achievements, I feel like... Messed up. Oh, is it going to give us another chance? I hit B. Every time I try to help, it, it, it <laughs> they die. It's over. You know, but 
Every time I try to help, they die. So what the heck? I thought if I run this time, it'd be different. Nope. I look. It's like darn if you do, darn if you don't. I love how it gives you that achievement. You save somebody, but they still die. Just love the, oh, shoot. Here comes the other one. I think it's locked. Oh. Oh, I missed. I missed. I missed. Is it gone? I don't see it anymore. We need to figure a way out of here before that thing finds a way in. Place looks like it burned down. Something here isn't right. Now, we're down to two people. I, I'm gonna get a horrible ending, probably. I, I know the best ending is when everyone survives. No! No! Ah! The heck is that? That's not even part of the crew. I'm saying, who the heck was that? Before we leave, let me see if there's any more secrets. I'm so sick of her. I should have confronted her. Seems like she's at the forefront of everything. Every time she shows up. <sighs> Successful parenting, huh? Who would have thought? Book on parenting. Setting limits. Parents unhappy with their own upbringing can overcompensate. They may not want their children to feel the same as they do about their own parents. They yearn to be friends with their offspring, so parents accept theories that encourage love as a solution to conflict. This leads to the belief that their children misbehave they should not be angry or punish them, but instead indulge in every... What? Spoiling a child in this way has grave consequences. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Children become demanding and disagreeable. Parents suppress anger at their child's behavior, but cannot help... A, but cannot keep a lid on their frustration until they explode, frightening and confusing the children. Parents feel guilty at the loss of what to do, feeding a new cycle of misbehavior. 
That's sort of true, though. This book. The problem lies with parents trying to be patient when patience is exhausted and the child needs correction. Yep. So is that book kind of telling us why Mary's acting the way she is? Tilly, whatever the heck her name is. <clears throat> James and Anne, 1948. You're going to want to see this. This is for real. Angela and I were married. It went upstairs, so we're in the family home. Can we go through this door? No. Dear Anne, thank you for your letter regarding Megan. I understand your concerns and assure you that your daughter's rebellious behavior is not unusual. I've helped parents with similar issues and will be happy to help with Megan's moral guidance. Hebrews 12.11 says that all deep discipline seems painful rather than pleasant, but later it yields the peaceful fruit of righteousness. Please see me after the service on Sunday so we can arrange time for some personal instruction. Stairs. Not yet. I'm not gonna open that yet. She went upstairs. What's this still? This still upstairs. My guess is the girl. It's still outside. Find her. She's in here. What do you think you're doing? It's okay. Trust me. Hey, Bigfoot. 
Find the goddamn vinyl, will ya? Don't be fooled by her, Andrew. No, wait. Will you protect me? You must. Wait, this isn't right. No way. I assure all gathered here today that our town will be free of the devil's grasp. Together, by God's grace, little hope will prevail. My word on it. This court is hastily convened, but with good reason. If we are to finally rid ourselves of the evil which has infested little hope, then we must act today. I accuse you, Mary, of witchcraft. What say you, Reverend? The evidence, as discovered through my investigation, is beyond question. Mary uses her poppet as a familiar to summon and serve the devil. God help us. We have been deceived by a child, by her guise of innocence. This poppet was mistakenly used to denounce Tabitha. But it has always belonged to Mary, and Mary alone. She allowed her own kin to be executed as she watched in silence. That is not so. Liar! Now this tainted child, this creature of Satan, has the marrow to accuse me, a man of God, of wrongdoing. Andrew, these people have lost their minds. This is collective hysteria, paranoia. We've got to intervene. Stop this somehow. It was never my intention to bring harm to this town. Or its people. Then you not help what can sure. I do? If I could do something to stop this, I would, but now in her hour of greatest need, I this child how. of the damned pleads once more for the Wait. devil's help. I beg the court's indulgence. Please guide me at this time. This I seek your counsel. Carver is evil. There's something wrong with the town. <laughs> we could say he's evil out of anger troubled no question there is something very wrong here right in the heart of this place there can be no doubt that little hope is afflicted that darkness has taken hold of our town there is not a man or woman here today who does not already know the devil is in our midst the sole purpose of this court is to remove evil, not indulge it further. Our time is not for wasting. He's right. Mary's behind all this. How do I make my All together now. If I am wrong, I condemn an innocent to die. Destroy the doll. Okay, here we go again. We can either destroy the doll. The reason I keep pausing it is so that I don't run out of fact. Uh, time so we can thorough decide here and I have only two seconds to make an executive decision um we can either destroy the doll again we didn't destroy it before but it was a choice before um or either just blame her but it, her the, what she's done though it seems like it is but now I feel like the game wants you to do that and make the grave the ultimate mistake to where they want you to think it's her, but it really wasn't the whole time. Like she was being controlled like a puppet. Maybe she was. The only way I can see out of this is to get rid of that damn doll. Destroy that and the puppet must be cast asunder. Maybe this all goes away. It is the cause of Mary's affliction. It holds her in its thrall. Destroy this puppet and the devil will depart Mary. She will be restored, an innocent child. Reverend, burn the puppet. Destroy it. We must not act in haste. The girl must face the full consequences of My her deeds. My authority is not for questioning. Do as I ask. This goes the way it's meant to. There's nothing more you can do now.
Is that the end of it? I'm not sure about that. I could have just made things a whole lot worse. It's over. We can leave. Wow. We could have made things. We could have. But I just feel like first I, I know at once I was like it's her, it's her, it's her. But now that I think about it, maybe she's being controlled. Cause it seemed like she's talking to somebody else in the beginning of the game. Remember when the house uh, caught on fire? Like, oh, she said you were right about my family. Trapped him in there. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, just like in the premonition. No. I didn't know I was going to. Oh, my God. This sucks. I thought I might find you here. <laughs> Whooping through the trenches, huh? That was the guy that was in the photo. I bet. Oh. Both of us been through some real tough time these past years. Nothing but ghosts left here now. Free piece of advice. You stay out of that place. This is what you had. Believe me, I know what I'm talking about. About 10 minutes down the road, there's a diner and got a working phone in it. Don't come back. Ain't nothing here for you no more. There's a bus driver. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. What? I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Can 
everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. What? Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. So we were him all along? That explains why we never ran into him. Anything you can do to help us would be greatly appreciated. There's no goddamn us. Oh my god. What the hell is going on in there? Get the hell out of here. I'll go once I look you in the eye. Now let me in. I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. <laughs> the bus driver all along. Are you kidding me? That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can get a different result. That's the problem with demons. If you don't lay them to rest, they will haunt you forever. Not a very happy ending. Nope. Or maybe it is. Depends no. on what makes you happy, really. <laughs> and you... Eventually, if everyone died but two people. What the heck? The bus driver. Right. Maybe he can now put the past behind him. Till we meet again. Maybe in the South Pacific, or the Arabian Desert, or somewhere else. But we will meet again. I know, it's an anthology. At least one more time. <laughs> I wonder what they're going to come out with next. What's the next one? It, it, it's insane. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. My name is Raven from the Sky. If you enjoyed the series, do me a favor and drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Grow. Take care. And I'll catch you guys in the next series. Peace out.